The E300 electronic overload relay supports a feature known as automatic device configuration. This feature allows the Logix controller to maintain all configuration data for the E300 electronic overload relay. Maintenance personnel can swap out a relay by just removing the hardware, reconnecting it, and the Logix controller will re-download the configuration data automatically to the E300. This video will show a little example of how automatic device configuration works. The Compact Logix L36 ERM is currently scanning the E300 electronic overload relay. We can tell this by the I.O. status light is a solid green. When communications fails, we see that the E300 is no longer communicating with the Logix controller. When maintenance personnel replace the E300 electronic overload relay, it'll be at its out-of-box default settings. As you can see, the full load amp setting changed from 1.00 amps to its default setting of 0.5 amps. Also, the single or three-phase parameter changed from single phase to three-phase. After maintenance staff replaced the E300 electronic overload relay, the Logix controller will re-establish communications during that process, all configuration data is restored back to the newly replaced E300 electronic overload relay. The default FLA setting changed from 0.5 amps back to 1.00 amps. And the single or three phase parameter was changed from the default setting of three phase back to the original setting of single phase. Automatic device configuration is a very useful feature for maintenance personnel. This demonstration video showed how easy it is to replace an E300 electronic overload relay without having to reprogram any of its configuration parameters.